That is a strategy I have never seen in a while. A player literally going to the other side of the court to kill the coach. <laughs> I feel like we made it funnier than it really was, though. <laughs> I don't fucking know. <laughs> uh, welcome back, guys. Uh, I'm Gast. I'm Pran. I'm Alusk. I'm Axis. And we're back playing Typhon's Wake. We just finished playing the prologue, and now we're on to, uh, oh. Uh, blah, 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 fuck. Uh, yes. Yeah. yeah, okay, here we go. We Best just finished the order. prologue, and now we're on beating the master. Classic Gast doesn't even finish the chapter. <laughs> God. I didn't see what I muted half the time. <laughs> yeah, Cyraxis was invisible. True This enough. place, it's so horrible. It's a ghost town destroyed by bandits. This is what we were fighting against. Ooh. Someone, um, someone lives here? Do you need any help? You seem distressed. Are you a band of mercenaries? I suppose? I'm a god. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a god amongst boys. Shush, God's Dave. band of disciples. <laughs> what do you need? It's the master. He senses trouble coming. You must protect him. I'll pay up, I promise. Follow me. There's a trap. <laughs> Who's the master? What was that all about? We're about to find out. Let's go ready your weapons. Oh, hello. I'm Madeline. Allow me to allow me to help you protect the master. Follow my orders. <laughs> <laughs> Obey. <laughs> Some thief. This guy looks shady. Everyone, get ready to fight. Whoa, slow down there, cowboy. I'm a good guy. Trust me. I steal from nobles and distribute to the poor. Just like literally every single thief I've ever seen. <laughs> Listen, the rough rhinos want to kill me. I just protected a poor old man from some brigands. I'll let you in with two conditions. The first is that you fight by our side. Agreeable. What's the second condition? I don't have a lockpick on me. Hey, what are you doing with my shoe? <laughs> <laughs> I thought you could hide from your lockpick from me, huh? Name's Robin. Of course it's Robin. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I wasn't expecting an FE13 cameo. <laughs> Sorry, the joke was too good to pass up. So not only is this kid a god, he also, like, knows thief things. <laughs> All at the age of 14. Yeah. He's like LeBron James. <laughs> <laughs> Small force of miscreants and has formed. I shall wipe them out and apprehend the old fool. Master Typhon will promote me for this grand catch. Okay, this is suspicious. Uh, big old village map, and there's six guys here. What do we got here? Hmm. A ween. Leader of the New Dawn. Ooh, that sounds cool. Nosferatu also. New Dawn sounds like a political party to me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it sounds like the neo-Nazi party. Yeah, that's what I'm. That's Texas the vibe. Taxes are too damn high. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking Go red with, luster. Uh, old Dawn. That can be your name, Old Dawn. <laughs> Refreshed Dawn. <laughs> New Air Dawn. Control R Dawn. Oh shit. That Robin thought he could cut he could hide from us, eh? Oh shit, now we're surrounded. Uh I'm pretty sure the story guy can still know the whole bottom left half. Yeah, what? probably. Wait, what? That's it. Send God, like a God to the repair. left. Oh, good call. Very smart idea. You have two vulnerabilities though. Are you guys missing anything? Oh they have a heater. Well, just in case. Okay, what do we got here? An iron axe, iron sword, a flux. Uh, Red gem to be stolen. Yeah. Looks like it's almost time to cuddle some trees, if you know what I mean. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, go into the forest, damn it. <laughs> okay, we're gonna bring you over here so you can attack me. You are gonna attack me, right? Oh, they're all gonna attack me. Ow! That hurt. Nice. I think he died. I think they're one our red gem. 
Holy cow. Oh, fuck. Uh... Yeah. Oh, gosh, that's a lot of dudes. You got it, bro. Dalton, just get in there. Yeah. Yep. He's on stop. Oh, fucking hell. Oh, Dalton. man. Dalton, you're so good! <laughs> Time to dodge tank. Actually, can you not even get hit? Or do you have the red gem? No, okay. No, we... The, the red gem died. I killed him? Oh. Yeah. Dude. Whoops. <laughs> Oh well, there's only three chapters in this, I probably won't Oops. need it. <laughs> oh. Alright, Alan! With the fire! Wow, oh. he one hit KO that guy? No, he. He's not too shabby. Hey, yeah! Uh oh. It'll be fine. Three yeah. damage, that's it? Oh my god, Dave, he's going off! Yeah. Not with the level ups though. <laughs> Look at this hit rate. <laughs> oh my god, another critical. Stop it, <laughs> Dalton. You're too good. <laughs> Look at this hit rates. Yeah, Dalton's oh just the god. How can you so be so whole, good at 14? Uh, map. Ike, is that you? <laughs> Dalton. Honestly, I was looking forward to having a trainee style protagonist who is terrible, and you raise him to a to be like really strong, but. If he's strong already, that works. Yeah. I'm telling you, man, he's LeBron James. I didn't like, notice his class was Commander. Yeah. I... It kind of... Yeah, I... Eh, to call him a Commander, but I guess he is. Jump I mean, it's, gun a it's more bit. suitable than Lord, at least. Yeah. His class can be... I dude. guess, like, Leader would make more sense, because Leader is kind of less formal. Or, a uh, God. <laughs> well, Some take on God. Villager. Or, or LeBron. <laughs> <laughs> About the goat. <laughs> <laughs> and your daily contribution is made by General Cyraxis. <laughs> so all these shaman worry me. They, yeah. Uh, well, I mean, we have two high res units here, so they won't be able to do much. Um, I don't have a javelin, do I? No, okay, so we're just gonna have to. That's annoying. Yeah, we're gonna have to see what happens here. Oh, they're going upwards. Oh, nice dodge. Nice dodge. Nice dodge. Mm, Appreciate not it. Not that she's really in that much danger, anyways. <laughs> Give me a crit. Oh, wow, I got hit by that. I got hit by a 28. Oh, fuck. And I got a bad level up, too. Is that the first time Dalton got a hit? Yeah. <laughs> this whole game so far. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye, perfect streak. Don't get hit. Oh shit. Oh shit, here comes Dalton. <laughs> <laughs> we got LeBron dribbling down the court hard. <laughs> LeBron cuts through the offense! <laughs> tries to capitalize, but he actually holds back a little bit, tries to zone out the defense, makes use of his surroundings here. The basketball court is fraught with obstacles. <laughs> Allen sets up Robin the for the- assist. Sets up the alley-oop! He gets it. That was probably a bad idea, actually, because now Flux Boy can probably kill him. Oops. Yeah, you were a little too gung ho there. Nope. Dodge it. <laughs> yes. And Robin Heck with yeah. the clutch defensive play, very <laughs> impressive. And Team New Dawn has made a substitution, and they have uh, put in eight new players on the floor. <laughs> Don't know if that's a legal move in basketball. <laughs> Not sure you can do that, but. Not really a These Canadians and their basketball <laughs> rules, man. Not really a substitution, more like an addition. It it seems that Coach <laughs> Oween has literally fired his whole team and replaced them with eight new players. <laughs> this is something I've never seen in an actual basketball game happening in real time. They're signing their contracts as they're running onto the court right now. <laughs> <laughs> Coach, you got a pen. <laughs> oh, pen. The Daltoners are uh, have even up the score here even though they seem overwhelmed by having literally half as many players on the court as the other team they're still gonna try to live it out Dave gets a water break <laughs> <laughs> oh man I can't yeah, take this. <laughs> maybe you should have moved to the woods while you had the chance <laughs> hmm maybe what are they packing? What kind of heat they got? Iron Just flavored standard, heat, looks like. Standard as fuck weapons. Uh, we'll be able to take him out. 
<clears throat> it looks like uh, the enemy has gone into a 4-0 offensive formation. And now uh, they're shifting onto the defensive side. Dalton is contemplating what he should do. 5 on 4 is a good breakaway point for the offensive team. Uh, a good change of pace here. Not too long ago, it was 8 players fighting the 5 Daltoners. I bet you LeBron could take out the fighter no problem. LeBron can easily destroy that guy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Can Allen wreck him? Yes. So there's two. <clears throat> Allen goes to capitalize against the soldier. Now, I don't know about you guys, but when I see this, mi this is just a clear mismatch. Uh, very poor, uh, you know, matchup decision by Coach Owen. Uh, I don't really know why he opted to do that. And now the now the offense is really just gonna clean up house here and really just take care of the only thing they have to take they worry about is the mercenary here. Don't know how they're gonna defend against that. And uh, this mercenary is uh, apparently in the running for MVP. <laughs> if there's one thing that Daltoners are good at though, is improvising on um, the court. Yes, you are correct. Remember that one time last chapter? Good God, that's the most that was artwork. That was artwork last chapter. Dunks all across the board. <laughs> and led by Captain uh, Captain Dalton. Of the Daltoners. Go figure. Go figure. I you know you know, if you asked me, couldn't a fourteen year old really play in the league? If you asked me that, you know, years ago, I would say never in a million years, but I'm surprised now. Today I learned like Mike is a documentary. <laughs> I have never seen anything this impressive in my life. And looks like Dave, the assistant captain, is going to miss a crucial hit. But it's okay, because he has Steve Robin to clean up the mess with a... With the assist. With, well, he would capitalize here. <clears throat> and Dave was for the assist. Oh, they go for the girl. Rude. <laughs> go for the medic. You know, at times like this, you'd think that you'd try to, you know, go back to your back to the bench here and try to get a water break, but uh, the mercenary is really going gung-ho and really trusting his MVP caliber performance of the last couple matches. And it looks like it's really backfiring on him because he's about to get his shit wrecked. Goodbye. Yeah, I'm thinking this is going to prove to be his Dawnfall. <laughs> <laughs> you just said Dawnfall. <laughs> I said Dawnfall. I, thought, I literally You should have just owned up to it. <laughs> 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 And they are moving in. That might have been a bad idea. <laughs> <laughs> Safe state. If there's one thing the Daltoners know how to do is rush the court. <laughs> yes, they are they are very well known for their offensive capabilities and they're actually last in the league in a points in points allowed. The first in the league in points given. And as you can see, uh, they're actually showing a very well defensive performance today, as they are not getting touched at all, specifically Dalton of the Daltoners. He has literally Actually, no, he actually almost got caught once. But these guys aren't moving. They're really going to try to go for the defensive position. I'm not really sure if it's going to work out for them in their favor. It looks like they're calling the Daltoners bluff and holding their um, uh, their play here. But is it enough? Can the new Don... Oh, the new Don misses a clutch, potentially oh. game-changing move. Oh, but looks like they can't really go on the offensive because Owen has a Nosferatu, and it looks like their coach is actually going into the game itself. But it looks like Coach Coach Dalton is going in for some pro strats here. Wow, look at these. Good God. And now they can't capitalize with their defensive position, and they're just going to pick off the enemy one by one. Here's Allen with a double. Very impressive stuff. They're going to have to go for the drop here. And they're sure, I don't know anything about basketball. <laughs> <laughs> Normally, dropping the ball is discouraged in play, but you know. And they're gonna and and they're gonna go for a test and see if the new dawn on the left wing is gonna go for the final is gonna go for the attack when the opportunity strikes. Now it's very crucial for the defending team to try to go for anything they possibly have to get an advantage. So we'll see what they do. And they go for the bait. Is it is it good? Is it gonna be good enough? Of course not, because Allen is too good. Despite the mismatch between fire and dark magic, it just does not matter for this team. They are a very well-oiled machine, and they cannot be stopped by traditional means. You gotta means. face it, the Dalners are unstoppable. It's like they're the Monstars and the Cleveland Cavaliers at the same time. They're the dream team. Man, We've that's the most I'll talk about basketball game. all year. <laughs> 
So Dalton might go for a very risky maneuver here by trying to go for the kill but also being risked getting attacked and then losing the opportunity because of the Nosferatu tone. We're going to see what he does here. Oh, it looks like they're, en they're engaging in some trash talk right now. Who do you think you are? I'll put you in your place. The new dawn and its, <laughs> and its great demon shall rise. Bwah! -ha. In fairness to the Daltoner, if killing the coach is a sound strategy for ending any game. <laughs> <laughs> Touchdown! <laughs> the coach Go. goes down. <laughs> that is a strategy I have never seen in a while. A player literally going to the other side of the court to kill the coach. <laughs> I have sure seen it all. <laughs> <laughs> and, and, and ironic, and you know, strangely enough, there seems to be no referees here. Uh, overseeing this match so literally anything goes and it's literally a bloodbath in this game the league must have paid them off in advance backdoor deals <laughs> to allow shady plays and it looks like Dave is gonna try to capitalize for the final kill of the match we used to be trying to score baskets here but now we're literally murdering people on the floor you know what they say in the long game anything goes <laughs> And this match is over in a bloody match between the Daltoners and the White Rhinos. Or the wild... What, what new were they Dawn. called? The New, the new Dawn. Dawn, right. They weren't even the Rhinos. The Rhinos were the other team that they slaughtered last chapter. Actually, there were a few in this chapter, weren't there? Yeah, they went to the bottom of the map, but then Dalton just killed them all. <laughs> yeah. so, Wait, this so is so actually teams, this is a furious two-on-one two on game. Wow, we couldn't even notice that because they're both so mediocre. <laughs> And their jerseys are both red. <laughs> <laughs> uh, thanks, I have a uh, question. They have to coordinate their wardrobes a little bit. <laughs> Wait, no, you're in the red uniform? Good. Dude, I'm in the red uniform. <laughs> well, they're crimson, and then the other guys are salmon. <laughs> Why do they call you the master? The master. I may not look like master. it, master. but I'm a thousand years old, kid. Gee. No, he looks like he's 40. Agnes, you have gray hair. <laughs> At least I have stash. hair. Look at that stash, though. This kind of sounds like a placeholder sort of mug, because they just made fun of his age, and he looks like his actual dad, and they just made fun of his hair, and he actually has hair. So I'm it's just gonna... actually one of the mugs I submitted to the open source gallery. Yeah. I'm excited to see it used, but hopefully it'll get replaced like the other one did. <laughs> I don't the know, stash, I, though, I'm not going to lie, I kind of preferred your your uh, your open source mug of Dalton before Dalton became Dalton huh. Dalton. Well, there are still traces of it in this one. Yeah, that's true. Do you know what the new Dawn group is up to? I didn't mean to put you in such harm. Their leader was talking about capturing an old man. To spread fascism throughout the world with basketball. <laughs> Cause everyone knows the Russians are behind basketball. <laughs> I think this boy may be worthy of the test. If you say so, Agnes. Kid, meet us at Asher Sunshine. Uh what? Oh shit. I guess I didn't really need to steal that. What was that? Where did oh, they go? Oh now we're getting magical. Madeline, who is the master? What's going on? I fear that I cannot reveal any more about the Master or his intentions. However, I can guide you to the shrine if you would like. Are you looking at who you're talking to? <laughs> Good point. Just keep your guard up in case she tries to pull a fast one. Maybe they are just being scammed into thinking they're having an adventure, but they're actually somehow <laughs> some convoluted way of um, partying them from their money. <laughs> By giving them gems worth 15,000 gold. <laughs> it's all part of the plan. <laughs> Here's her lockpick. Now it's time for you to head off. It's, it's luring them into a false sense of security. It's like the I Truman Show. Time. Exactly. Now how about we head to the shrine of those teleporting people? <laughs> the the shrine word. of the old teleporting people. <laughs> You'll know all that you'll know all you need to know about us teleport breed. Got the lockpick. Actually, okay. Robin. Why did they even steal the lockpick? Everything's kinda of rummaged. Anyway. Uh 
What do you guys think of that chapter? I mean, I was just laughing, and I'm at, and I'm just you know, I I, I think you know, the master was introduced way too quickly. Yeah, he's kind of like, yo, I'm the master, so serious. Yeah, he seems, he kind of seems like he's like low key, like just the goto of the game. I'm the master. <laughs> the master, and you don't really know why he's the master. You just kind of, I mean, I mean were, he asked why, but we can't explain because reasons. Yeah, because I'm plot. too mysterious. <laughs> Watch me teleport away. <laughs> um, in terms, the map is a little too. I think LeBron sparse. is MP MVP of this game. Yeah, LeBron. LeBron is really good. But yeah, uh, Skull, you said something about the map. Uh, the map is a little too sparse. It could be more closely packed with the houses and the forest and stuff. Yeah, I think I don't really mind the size too much because it kind of seemed like you weren't like using a lot of the space but I think it'd be nice to like actually make the map look more interesting looking because it just kind of seemed like it's yeah like like you said like a sparse big wide rummaged kind of repeated spammy-ish kind of map going on so uh for map in my opinion uh a more interesting map having but like keeping the sort of same game elements you want to have is probably a decent idea I guess one Cyraxis. idea would be to make. Oh, oh sorry. God. I was gonna make a joke about Cyraxis not being here, but he's probably still oh, I'm here. <laughs> I'm here. Huh. I'm here. Are you less busy now? Not dirty. Well, yeah. <laughs> Maybe he's busier. May Scholar, what are you gonna say? Easy. One idea would be to pack the map very close with like ruined houses and stuff, so that uh, there would be obstacles you could lure the enemies around, and then you could make them fall into a certain order where you could pick them off. Because I noticed how the enemies walked around the ruined houses rather than going through them. So you could probably take advantage of that somehow. Oh, well, maybe. If they weren't so sparse. Yeah. But, yeah, it... Yeah, I liked I liked how I could bring Dalton over to the bottom and have him, like, destroy the shit out of those rhinos. <laughs> that was pretty fun. That was kind of cool. I was like, hey, those rhinos are back. Yeah, whatever. We got Dalton. <laughs> I'll just kill everyone. I'm kind of. I'm kind. I'm, I'm curious if everyone in this game's a kid, because they don't really seem to like notice that there's a 14 year old like beating the shit out of everyone. <laughs> even the dad doesn't even notice. Like, I mean, granted, the dad's like this throwaway kind of NPC guy that's just literally there to like show that Dalton doesn't really care about his family because his dad doesn't really care about him. But like, the 14 year old thing requires a little suspension of disbelief. But yeah, but. We're playing a game. <laughs> so... As long as it's consistent, that's what matters. Yeah. Anyways, it's cool. Yeah, it's fine. I'm cool with it. Uh, so that was chapter one, meeting the master for a very brief amount of time. Uh, we're gonna finish off this patch. I think there's one more. It either goes to chapter three or there's three chapters in it. I always get confused by this. Um, anyway, uh, I'm Gast. I'm Prime. I'm Alusk. I'm Sir Axis. And we'll catch you guys later. On the flip. Oh. <laughs> oh, shit. All right. Peace.